In the year 2000 and beyond, this majestic ship that we christen here today may still be sailing the oceans of the world. We pray that her years will be years of peace. But if she must fight, both the flag she flies and the name she bears will carry a profound message to friend and to foe alike. For the 5,000 Americans who will man this great ship, and for all of their countrymen whose hopes ride with them, this is a moment of reflection. We have just completed the last deck cycle of this cruise and are headed 283 degrees true for Pier 12 at Norfolk Naval Base. You've had a tough time of it lately, but you've done a fine job. Well done to all hands. I sit alone, permanently moored to a pier. Reminder to the city of Philadelphia, the power of American shipbuilders and the generations of volunteers. I stand majestic, ready to defend a nation that loved my namesake and legacy. My single haze gray tone has deteriorated into a faded patchwork of paint. My issues are cosmetic, not holistic. I am strong, formidable, self-confident in my abilities and share these qualities with those who joined me at sea. I've seen years of combat and decades of peace. Crew artwork graces my bulkheads like tattoos from my many years at sea. These images tell our story of war and peace. I wear them with pride. are quiet, where once we gathered to break bread and celebrate milestones, now feels cold and alone. The final galley menus remain displayed on my walls, our last meal, a celebration. I supply the crew with the necessary comforts of home as they deploy to the other side of the earth to support our nation. Final messages to me are written in permanent marker on my walls. They are a lasting testament to the love we shared. I've taken care of all of you like you've taken care of me. We were there to patch each other up if we were damaged. We always came back stronger. weathered storms and setbacks. Our strength was our teamwork, and with that, we moved the oceans. My body is slightly weathered, but my spirit is as strong as my anchor chain. sailors that joined me in combat, but I am tired. I feel my adventure has come to an end. It's time to pass our legacy to a new generation. I am the USS John F. Kennedy, and I am reborn. <laughs>